69 over there. 69. I'm taking it back to you. I'll clean your house naked. <laughs> 69, naked. I just want to tell my parents, I hope that this makes them proud and somehow makes up for all the <laughs> that I do <laughs> all the time. You are two of the most selfless people, and you have taught me and all my siblings how important it is to be there for those who need us and how important it is to care about other people in their lives. So thank you for making me say that. And, um, People say that they don't choose their family, but I choose my family every time. And I think that even if you weren't my mom and dad, I'd hope we'd still be in the room together looking for a cure. So thank you very much. <laughs> thank you. Welcome to the future. No, your eyes don't deceive you. This is what tomorrow's gaming will look like. The next generation of virtual reality headsets from Oculus Rift being demoed at E3 in LA, and the punters are on board. It was amazing. It was a little bit complicated at first because you don't use your hands, you don't use, uh, you just use your eyes. It feels very immersive in terms of the visual effects. Sony and Microsoft were also showing off their new virtual reality accessories. Previous generations of so-called VR equipment have been clunky and promises of future progress seemed a long way off. But CNET senior editor Dan Ackerman thinks the future might finally be here. Sony has their Morpheus headset that should work with your PlayStation 4. Microsoft has the HoloLens, which is a very experimental thing. It's more augmented reality. And a company called Oculus is actually owned by Facebook. That's sort of the market leader. They were the first guys with like really workable hardware. That should finally be available to buy early next year. There are worries about how much these new entertainment sets will cost, but for those here, it's mainly excitement at the progress being made with the technology. This year's E3 runs until June 18. We play 70s, 80s, 90s, and today's music on Vibes Live. Crazy. Crazy. 